checking the stats every minute this week. I'm doing my part, I'm paying attention, and I play my position. It's Crypto Lights here, we're back with another Zen Crypto video. I wanted to cover Zen just very briefly in this video uh, because I have some uh, some Zen FT mints. Um, I've got a couple of Zen FT mints to claim um, on Avalanche, okay? Um, it's not going to be a great news video uh, because I'm actually not claiming this Zen at the moment only because... It, it makes more sense for me to buy at this point, okay? What I did is I laddered in a bunch of Zen mints, okay, on, on Avalanche, okay? As well as Finance, Smart Chain, Phantom, um, Evmos, a bunch of chains, right? I've done it on, okay? Um, did one on Pulse Chain, um, decided that the gas was too high to do that. So the minting of Zen FTs is not being great. Now, there's a lot of Zen to collect. There's a lot of Zen to collect. However, it's just not worth a lot. Okay, if you look at, for example, the Avalanche Zen chart, okay, this is the problem with a project that's highly volatile like this and, you know, that, that people just don't understand the concept and, you know, it may take time for it to mature, okay? Um, the price of Avalanche Zen went absolutely crazy, okay, with the, uh, I believe it was the Phoenix launch, made this go crazy, Polygon went crazy, and a bunch of Zen chains went crazy, However, because people can mint so much of it, right? A lot of people were minting these NFTs from early, right? People are just selling it down. Okay, so if we do a measured move from the bottom of here, okay, at the peak of this move, it was approximately ten, it was eight to ten thousand percent, right? So the dump on a Zen is a, uh, you know, it's is is uh, it just makes the the Zen that you claim like with the gas fee. Right, the gas fee that I paid, which was around six dollars at the time, right, and then the claim fee, which around about is around about a dollar, and for example, like the 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 amount of Zen I could claim today on just one of these is about two dollars, okay, worth of Zen, and then the because uh, uh, I've got two claims to claim today, for around two dollars each, okay, cost a dollar ninety seven cents on Avalanche to claim it right now. Uh, it just means that I'm in a loss. Okay, so it was spent six dollars. Okay, now of course this can come back up, but what I'm saying is you've got to be careful with the strategy. Okay, um, at the end of the day, I did a bunch of NFTs, and and and, and you know some of them were short, some of the some of them were long, but it just goes to show that longer pays better. Okay, um, but even the top Zen NFT that I have it cost me six dollars to mint. Okay. I'm getting 1.08 billion Zen for that, which is worth at today's price $33. So we've got to wait 412 days for $33 worth of Zen. And the question is, is, is this lower in 412 days, the price of Zen, or is it higher in 412 days? Does it go into a full on bull market? Okay, now the problem is Zen is on a bunch of multiple chains, okay? And of course, I've told you before, my favorite is Ethereum Zen, okay? That's where the most volume is. That's where the most users are, okay? And, um, you know, that's uh, that's a chain for whales, okay? Um, and uh, But on Avalanche, okay, we don't know whether it can come back. People might look at this, look at the low liquidity at 2.5K, 336K market cap and say, you know what, forget that. Unless, uh, unless another project comes out, there are not a lot of people are, I don't see the Avalanche be, I mean, Avalanche is a good chain. It's a, it's a popular blockchain. I believe it's going to do well in a bull run. So, you know, at the end of the day, it's just speculation. Will it come back? Can it come back? I just wanted to give you that update because, you know, at the end of the day, my strategy <laughs> on this hasn't paid off. And it's just all to do with timing. It's just all to do with time. If I was able to claim my Zen over here, so I'll be making a good news video and saying, wow, that was a great strategy. Because the price of Zen has come down and there's a bunch of people on top of you claiming or selling it down, a bunch of people are in profit, they were they were buying it over here, they were minting it over here, you know, and they're all taking profits over here. It just means you're you're left holding the bag uh, because of the long, long out process in being able to claim it. Okay? Um so if you do claim it, of course, the strategy will be to hold it. Okay. Uh, right now, the short term mints that I, I did. Uh, they're, they're probably not worth claiming at the moment, okay? Because just because of the gas fee and, and, and all that sort of stuff, okay? So, you know, um, yeah, I mean, I just wanted to put it out there. Um, that is Avalanche Zen at the moment. 
Um, I've got again. I've got Zen on other chains that I'm gonna need to like. For example, uh, like Binance Smart Chain. I didn't do any Zen FT mints on Ethereum because the gas fees were too high. But for example, Binance Smart Chain. I haven't done the math on it. Okay, but um, my mints were all long term mints on the Binance Smart Chain. The Avalanche was was basically my experimental network where I was uh you know doing. I I did um I did mints. Uh, every month so I'm, every 30 days i'll be able to claim on avalanche okay so this is my first claim on avalanche but um yeah 30 days later the price has just dropped like just a lot okay and um it would take a catalyst obviously to get this to pump again but because it has done it before it does go to show that it can do it again but we had these mini pumps before these mini pumps but this was the big one okay so people are going to sell that off um and you might see some mini pumps along the way um yeah but um yeah it's going to take something big to obviously get it get it pumping for me like jack levin is all over the place he's he's basically you know on bitcoin the, the ordinals brc20 is on pulse chain is you know he's everywhere okay but we know that somewhere along the line the x1 chain is coming and it's for somehow we're going to be able to bridge all of this together okay guys but right now, it makes more sense. Even if, if I wanted to hold Zen, it makes a lot of sense. Just at these levels, it makes a lot of sense to just buy it. Okay? Buy it. It's not worth the gas fee at the moment, in my opinion. Let me know what you think in the comments, guys. Do me a favor and subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed already. Tick the little bell for notifications. Like the video if you like this content. All right, guys. And yeah, sorry it couldn't be a better video for you today. But it is what it is. I'll see you in the next video.